gentlemen. I'm not going to pass up an opportunity to say some uh, remarks. Thank you to everybody for being here. My friends, our city is at a crossroads. Current leadership says that we are on the right direction. We're on the right track. I disagree. Violent crimes have increased annually in our city over the last four years. That's not the right direction. We have seen massive curriculum cuts and teacher layoffs under this administration. And we are currently in court with surrounding communities who are looking to educate their children elsewhere. That's not the right direction. And when times have been difficult, we have seen fingers pointed again and again at the working men and women of our community. That is not acceptable, that's not the right direction, and we can do better. Yeah. Yeah. We can do better than discussions about minimum standards in our schools. We can do better than politics and business as usual at City Hall. We can do better. We can do much, much, much better than a my way or the highway approach to governing. That is not leadership. I'm running for mayor because Manchester is a city of opportunities. We are a city of untapped potential. What we have seen, however, over the last four years is that we have been denied both the vision and the leadership to make many of these opportunities a reality. We have vast resources and dedicated professionals in our city. We have the potential to provide academic excellence to the 16,000 students of the Manchester School District. If you believe, as I do, that we have that potential, not that we're there today, but that we have the potential to set the New Hampshire standard for education, we need you on this campaign. Yeah. Yeah. We can do much, much better to attract businesses, to attract innovation, to attract jobs to the city of Manchester. And not just any jobs, jobs that can support a family. And if you believe, as I do, that we can do much better on this front than what we have seen over the last four years, we need you on this campaign. And you got us! <laughs> thank you. Please don't forget, make no mistake, campaigns are not about individuals. They are about groups of people coming together for a common goal, coming together for a common cause. This city used to hold the promise of being the best place to live, of being the best place to raise a family in the state of New Hampshire. Over the last four years, in many, many ways, we have gotten away from that identity, we have lost that identity. So if you believe that restoring that promise of our great city is something worth fighting for. If you believe that that is a cause that is worth advocating, it is a cause worth restoring, we need you on this campaign, this very day, this very minute. We need your help. Yeah. I'm joined by my lovely wife, Kathy, who I cannot thank enough for her support and especially for letting us do this. Yeah. Most people here know, and if you didn't know, you're learning today, that uh, we welcome the new addition to our family, a baby girl, Abigail. She is with us. Hey. 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 Abigail. I don't know about that. When Abigail is old enough to ask questions about this race, what are we going to tell her? You won! <laughs> when children and families of our city ask questions about the race for mayor this year, what are we as a community going to tell them? We won. <laughs> I say we tell them that when you see something that's wrong, you do not stand idly by. You do not stand passively and watch it happen. You stand up and you do what you can to change it. That's exactly what we're going to be doing on this campaign, and that's exactly what I'm asking every single person here and the thousands of city residents that agree with us that we can do better to do. Okay? For my family, this effort officially begins with me signing some papers inside City Hall in just a few minutes. And I invite everybody here to come in uh, with us as we do that. That's not where it stops. Not by a long shot. This campaign is about neighbors speaking to neighbors, family members speaking to family members, friends speaking to friends. 
and people right here today to speak with the strangers, to people who live in our community, who care about our community, who want good schools, they want safe streets, they want us to be the best place with the best quality of life again. These are all things we're fighting for. I thank you again for being here today as we kick off this campaign, and I look forward to working with all of you, listening, and uh, speaking to all of you about ways to make this happen as we continue this campaign over the next several months. Thanks so much for being here.